Welcome to the first in the Panel Pilot A series of basic tutorials. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you the interface um, that the Panel Pilot Ace Design Studio has, just so that you can find the um, tools that you need to begin creating your projects. So, we're going to start. This is when you first load up the software, you'll be presented with this home screen, um, links to the tutorials, and so on. Um, down here, there's three tabs we've got the Getting Started. Um, templates so this is pre-created templates that are supplied with the software and also recent projects obviously this is the first time we've loaded the software so there's nothing in there yet I'm going to just jump right into the design view so I'm going to open up the uh, device default project and when we double click on that that's going to create a project on our hard drive and take us through to the design view so the design view is made up of five primary panes. Um, we can play with the interface a little if we want to make one of them bigger or smaller. Uh, we can even undock them and then double click to, to put them back on. So up here we've got our project browser. Um, this Here we're able to switch between screens in the project. This is just a one screen um, project. We could add a second one if we wanted to here. I'm going to just create that and delete it. And we can also see all of the images that we've imported to use in our project up here. Um, to show you how to do that you just right click and add new or you can just drag images straight into the, the software. Down here on the left we've got our library and this is where all of the tools and um, functions and behaviors and the hardware integration that we need to create our projects is. Um, so to cr So to add these to our project we just simply drag them on and you see it appear down here in the function builder. Uh, the function builder shows the relationships between all of the different um, elements that we're using within our projects. Um, so we've got here on the left the visual elements, the function elements, which is the behaviors. So for example, with this project we have a rotating needle and you can see that the behavior there up here in the project set, properties editor, that that behavior is configured up here. And then that's also linked to a hardware input. So needle meter input here that's looking for an analog input on the SGD 43A 0 to 4 volts um, and we link that you can see up here in the analog input element that's where we're making that that link we're setting the scaling we're setting the uh, rotational angles um, and so that's how we build up projects within the panel pilot ace design studio Finally, there is the um, the stage or the screen editor, and here we can zoom in and out of our project. Um, we've got the undo and the forward buttons. Um, we can save. We can center the screen if we need to. Um, and then, as with any software package, we have a top menu here, so you can access the um, help files, um, undo, and then the file elements such as save, save as, exporting and so on. It's worth just showing you one other thing here which is the preview um, in emulator and this actually emulates the SGD43A hardware. So what I can do is, is simulate an analog input. We talked just a moment ago about this project being set from 0 to 4 volts so I can emulate how that how the project would behave when I put 0 to 4 volts in, in channel input 1 and similarly with input level 2. And I can also simulate a touch input by clicking on this little toggle switch here and that just turns off some graphical elements and changes the background. So that's a very short little introduction to the um, interface. Um, the rest of the tutorials in this series cover in a little bit more detail how to actually start building up your projects.